Now, to help us focus on how best to invest for our retirement and achieve the life we want, Senior Wealth Advisor Leslie McCormick of the Farwell Group, author of the book Bank on Yourself, Why Every Woman Should Plan to Be Financially Single Even If She's Not, joins us. Good morning, Leslie. Good morning, Marilyn. What do you have for us today? Well, as you know, I am quite passionate about improving investor confidence. Having confidence in your finances, whether that's in your knowledge, your financial position, the direction you're going, it brings a peace of mind about your future. And confidence isn't just about what is happening right now with the market. It's about feeling good about your own ability, having a clear, achievable plan. It's about knowing that you are in control of your finances not having your finances control you. And so I found some fairly recent research quite interesting. Julie Littlechild conducted a study for Investments and Wealth Institute, and the resulting 2020 investor research provides us with some interesting insights on client self-confidence. And while this research was focused on how advisors can help clients become more self-confident about their finances, I believe it actually provides an excellent insight for investors, too. We know that investors who work with an advisor generally do have higher levels of confidence and build more wealth than those who are unadvised. But this research can help investors assess the quality of advice that they're getting and identify the areas to focus their conversations with advisors on in a way that will help build their self-confidence over time. Well, there were a number of statements and areas that the research found investors who are confident in their finances are able to answer in a positive way. I'm going to share five of the main areas with you. First of all, a focus on planning. An investor who has high levels of financial self-confidence can usually say, I am clear about my financial goals, and my advisor fully understands my life goals. They have an advisor who is delivering on core expectations, satisfied with their long-term performance and returns, and comfortable with the level of risk in their portfolios and their plan. Their advisor provides meaningful guidance, and they can rely on their advisor to help them make difficult decisions, and that their advisor helps them understand the impact that market turbulence can have on their plan. An investor who has a high degree of self-confidence typically has meeting experiences where they feel energized and inspired about their future and get a great deal of value out of those review meetings. Those conversations with their advisors go beyond investments. Confident investors typically can say, I get support beyond managing my money and investments, and that my advisor adds value above and beyond investment performance. Ideally, if you want to improve your levels of financial confidence, focus on these areas in your relationship with your advisor. Because having a high level of self-confidence about your finances, that really is priceless. So basically, confidence is important. And I guess if we stand still and we don't build that relationship we're not accomplishing as much as we could. So moving more in our financial planning is as important as moving more when we're moving physically as well. So thanks for that information. Now, I have signed copies of your book, and Mother's Day is coming next month, but I'm almost out. So could you provide me with some more, please? I certainly can, Marilyn. Thank you. So anyone listening who wants to get Leslie's book, 
bank on yourself, why every woman should plan financially to be single if she's not, a signed copy would be a wonderful gift. And since we're talking about moving forward in life, you can plan forward for Mother's Day and know that you'll have a gift in the mail if you call me at 416-504-6777. And back to you, Leslie. If someone wants advice uh, how to gain confidence and build their financial plan, what do you recommend they do? If you'd like a consultation with us, please feel free to give us a call at 416-863-7501. 416-863-7501. The Farwell Group, a team of experts that can give you confidence so that you know that you will be happy in your retirement. Thank you, Leslie, and I look forward to getting the books. Thank you, Marilyn.